Nation Station. Well, they're right here in studio with us this morning talking about something pretty basic. Well, or acidic. Well, depending on the pH, we're going to figure that one out. Amy Kress has an experiment to explain all of this acidic and basic knowledge to us. Good morning, Amy. Good morning. So what we're doing today is we're going to use just a plain red cabbage head um, and try to figure out if some of these household items here are more acidic or basic. So we need to make a bre breakfast smoothie. Is what <laughs> kind you're going like to tell us. Yeah, we're just going to use the leaves, okay. but there are also all kinds of experiments to do with the rest of the cabbage head. Um, you can check those out on our website. But like I said, we're just going to use the leaves today. Okay. So we're going to put this in the blender. Right. Water's in the blender, correct? Yes, yeah, so we're going to have some water in there. Blend it up. It's a really, really fun experiment. You can try at home. All you need is a cabbage um, and some household items, some water. Stuff like that. Should have this stuff laying down. All right, let's blend right. this up. <laughs> and we're going to basically make this a liquidy mixture at this point. Right. And if you don't have a blender at home, you can actually just boil the cabbage leaves. And you see it turn into this nice purple oh, color. Yes. There we go. There we go. It's making me thirsty, too. <laughs> All right, so it's going to turn into this nice purple color we have here. So we're going to go ahead and strain it over here. Okay. Now, this purple color we see here is our actual acid base indicator, this purple juice down here. Okay. All right, that's the good stuff that we want for this experiment. Right, that's exactly what we're going to be using here. So, Chris, why don't you go ahead and put about a fourth cup into each one of these beakers here. Okay, and yeah. again, inside each beaker is, is just water. Just correct? water, right. So, as we're going to see here, it's going to start to change the color all of even our water. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Okay. So water is actually a neutral kind of substance here. It's not too acidic, okay. it's not basic, and that's good, right? We, we don't want our water to be right. too acidic. So blue is kind of the neutral color here. Okay. So this is a good color to have. All right. And one more to go. Yep, one more. And what we're going to do is we're going to add some of the items that we have here to okay. each one of our beakers and see what, what happens. All right, okay. what do we start with? Um, I want to start with this lemon here. What do you think, acid or base? Uh, a lemon, uh, citric acid, it's got to be acidic. I think that's probably a pretty good okay. guess. So go ahead and squeeze it into one of our beakers. Okay. Nice, good squeeze there. Okay. So let's stir it up a little bit. Hey. Okay. And it turned a nice pinkish color, right? So our pink is going to be a very acidic substance. So we're right on. Exactly. Citric acid, acidic. Okay. All right. So let's try some Windex next. We have some glass cleaner. All right. I have no clue because I've never tried this before. Don't think so. And it's not a good idea to do that. So I'll go the opposite end. I'm just gonna say basic. Okay. So go ahead and squirt a lot of lot of different squirts in there. Okay. About eight or nine or so. Okay. That's good. Okay. And so it changed our water kind of a green color, right? Right. And green's going to be more basic. You're right. All right. Our glass cleaner has ammonia in it, which is a base. So We are two for two at this point. We are. We're going to move this down to this end, actually, because we're going to make kind of a spectrum. Okay. okay. So we have acidic down here. We have basic down here. All right. So let's try, um, how about we try that club soda over there? All right, club soda. This is something you can drink. Um, I'm going to go acidic again. Acidic? Okay. So go ahead and pour that in. Uh, this one, correct? Yeah, that's good. All right. Okay. Uh -uh. All right. That's a nice purple color. Okay. And you're right. That is acidic. Okay. It's more acidic. Okay. Very good. So we've got the club soda. We've got the lemon over here. All right. We have two more to go here. We have an egg. Okay. Okay. So what we're going to do is crack the egg, and we're just actually going to use the egg whites for this one. Okay. So what do you think? Acidic uh, or basic? Basic. Think so. Is going to be my guess on this. <laughs> okay. So let's go ahead, pour that in. You can stir it up a little bit. Okay. All right, and it makes it looks a nice kind of basic to me. It is basic. All right. So we have some basic substance in our egg whites there. Okay. Okay, and we're just gonna leave this as it is. This is gonna all be right. kind of our neutral. So we've got all these acids, these bases over here, and the middle is our neutral water. And that is your spectrum then. That's how you rate if it's basic or acidic from a basically a whole spectrum. It is. And the cool thing is you can try this at home. You can try it with a cabbage head. Um, and then you can use any household items, items really that you have. You can use milk, pop, candy, anything Perfect. like that. Just test them out. All right, Amy, thank you so much. You guys are still rocking on with Mindbender Mansion as well. So we appreciate you coming in and sharing some of these yes. experiments with us. And of course, you could check that out. Imagination Station going through April 29th. Amy, thanks again. Thank you. All right, cell phone reception. Is it 